What's going on YouTube? Happy Thanksgiving. And today we're gonna go take a look at my coworkers new Husky toolbox. And this is the 56 inch flip top kind of tool cart roll cab mix hybrid kind of a thing. So without further ado, let's check it out. Let's go. guys this is one of the cart in here i wanted our utility tech actually she's a female she's a it's a husky toolbox and i think that's really cool flip soft like this i like that you can do that and have like a space to put your tools it right here not like a regular cart or a regular roll cap you can put it down it actually has one two three four five so it has ten drawers total eleven you include the big one she already bought some sockets it's pretty cool And this one is my favorite part of this toolbox is that you have this power drawer right here. You can put your power tools right here. You can see she bought some tools already. Bought some wrenches. She bought some flare nut wrenches, which is pretty cool. Let's try to buy some stuff already. <laughs> some ratchets. Some hammers, which you can see she hasn't used yet. Oh, she has a lot of extension. <laughs> Some glad hands, which is this is pretty cool. This is for if you guys don't know what this is, this is to check your tractor protection valve. Screwdrivers. Oh, he, she has a lot of ratchet straps. Use this for drive lines most of the time to hold it up. And some knee pads. That's it. And I believe she got this for like around 750. Before 750, I think that's worth the money. Some of the uh, Jordan Mintz gave you this tech, this little tabs. Every time you finish a certain class and finish the instructed lead classes, you get one of those. And luckily, our toolbox, if you're an intern, not an apprentice, an intern in a school, they provide us with a shop toolbox, which is right here. This is what she currently uses right now. And uh, this Husky toolbox is pretty cool too. So this is our what she uses right now and that is her like own toolbox. So that's about it guys. So if you guys noticed that on this video, I'm actually working out right now and uh, I just thought of finishing this video because uh, it's been delayed. I actually shot that intro about thanksgiving and then now it's like monday morning and i shot the original video it was back in beginning of november and now i to, i've been really busy so i'm just trying to finish this video but that's kind of there here or there and also if you notice that i am speaking kind of low-key it's because that i'm on my 10 minute break and i'm trying to stay low-key because uh, I don't want anybody showing up my video while I'm shooting it because it kind of ruins the mood when somebody just pops in the video. And also, I'm trying to respect my coworker's privacy. I know a lot of people are not regarding that and more not being considered of other people's privacy, but I'm trying to keep that as much as possible because not a lot of people want to be in a video, you know, I'm trying to be, trying to live their, uh, 
low key life and I respect that. And that's what we have this, that's what we lack this day is this, the lack of respect to each other. And I'm trying to have that, spread that positivity that we have to respect people's privacy and opinions and stuff. But speaking of opinions, my opinion on this 63 inch toolbox or flip top toolbox is that this is the best, the, the best, T-H-E, B-S-T, toolbox slash tool cart for a beginning apprentice or even a loop tech. And this is the reason why is that the fact that you have a tool cart and you have to bark when I'm making a video. So the fact that it's a flip top with a workbench can really benefit an entry level tech to help with his uh, organization because I know the tool cart will benefit you for your to org to have more organized and more efficient on where your tools is at. And this toolbox or flip top toolbox, uh, you can benefit on both sides because you have a workbench. At the same time, you have your favorite tools or your most used tools on your left side or your right side. So you have the best of both worlds. And what happens if you just choose a roll cap, which is a good thing because you have a top or a bench to work with and you can put your fuel filters or oil filters or your parts there and you can fill out your paperwork and do diagnostic or search our, search uh, service manuals on that. That's all good and dandy, but you had to open up your toolbox every time you need to do something. Um, you guys know what I'm talking about. Like when you have a job that you are not familiar with and you still have to look at the service manual, you have to keep <laughs> like lift, lifting the drawers for the tools that you need instead of just having it right there. You can just really right there. I need a 10, I need a ratchet right there. You can just grab it right and on, a, on a tool cart, but on a roll cart, you have to do this. You gotta do that and that kills your efficiency. So with this toolbox, you have the best of both worlds. Like I said earlier, you can have you can have your laptop on your right side, have your most used tools on the left side, and be more efficient. And this is why these this is the best tool cab or flip top toolbox for an entry level tech. All right, guys. So that is about it for my video. And again, this is just my opinion and coming from the perspective of an apprentice. But if you have any opinion against this video or this toolbox, let me know what you think down below. And if you like this video, click that like button. And if you want to support my channel, click that subscribe button. Other than that, man, I'm out. Peace. That's what I'm working on right now. Transmission clutch. That's my, my toolboxes. So that's about it.